We let this rodent problem go on too long. It's not their fault. All right, boys. We're going to the vets. Hey, you just relax! their physicals, teeth scrubbed, nails clipped, ears swabbed, a play done. Hey, boys. <laughs> Meet the Swatter 5000, a.k.a. the answer to... Hey, this is our home, too. Sign of the enemy. Oh, did we chase the widow mice away? <laughs> Commence Operation Pied Piper. Come back for us. Any second now, you'll see. I know he will. Coming back. We're never getting out of here. Shh. Mission a no idea what's coming. My bare hands. Bare hands? Get some cheese chewers. I'm hungry. No! On the run now, runts! I'd rather have mice! Not until the objective is reached, ma'am. I don't want to go back to base. I want to finish the mission, sir. You online, are you? Mike. Maybe we should start our own business. Jerry and... The other side of that door is... Got it! It made me feel pretty. You see? Thought you went home. Mistaken identity. Maybe I didn't see you. So, we did the world game. Hey now. Just relax. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I... <laughs> Those McCracken sisters aren't going to be riding off with the... Thomas! <laughs> Focus, Thomas. Knew that elf skin Belinda McCracken's face when the witch master called. The p Did we miss one hair plucked from the head of a black cat? Tommy's of plucking it or it won't work. Got it? And in you, have I made myself clear? Toodles, may I have your hand in marriage? In marriage, too unoriginal. Marry cat. Ning and living in the castle and wearing fancy clothes. Too weird. Runner-up showing a date with my chambermaid. Meet Helda. Oh, let's start this competition with a little archery. Hear ye, hear ye. Ye tournament of... This one. Ah! 
the best cheese sculpture of turtles. Winner of the final event will be deemed most worthy. A new home. Yay me. You're right. Ours. Because you didn't get it back here in town. Exciting. <gasps> Just who you came to see. Do we have here? <laughs> For me. The other hand. You seem like a more substantial meal. Treats. There's plenty for you too. I guess it's time for us to eat. With the eat and run. Your baby. Good you go. Good you go. Good you go. I know we wanted to see the wildlife of Africa. Enough. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now we're going to practice special jumps. Good on you, kids. He's all around. Someone. Now off with you. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> you say the nicest things. Mm. Oh. Cutting in on another bloke's sealer, are you? Fight like a roo! You're the most pathetic baby platypus I've ever seen. My burrow and raise you as my very own. Oh, you're going, little mister. It's time for a hearty brekkie. It's an insect lava. Have you ever seen a more beautiful garden? And for her biscuits? <laughs> Remove the dreadful nuisance. It's a sweet effort and all, but this thing is a little scrawny.
Africa up close and personal, but that was a little too close for my... Ashamed of yourself, mate. Bean. But I'm sure a mother's tender affection would be Crikey! I've never been a mother! You grandparents! And I made you an ankle biter classic! and exotic the flowering can
baskets of fruit and a... In fact, I'm going to give you each five dollars. This is meant for... Delivery charge that comes to ten thousand dollars. And his cat, who coincidentally is also named Thomas. The event... Pendants. Oh, I shall not be swayed by your laziness, Tom. To <laughs> Have you seen the document on my desk? It is of the utmost importance. It depends on you getting it back. Mm -hmm. So you're the treasonous d huh? Definitely the bone. Yankee Kitty came to town, trees and us and folk. <laughs> ah, look! I knew he would not fail me. Well done. Oh, uh, look, this is an outrage! Look! So oh, on that day, July 4th, 1776, the... All stay together. We've seen lots of amazing things from the his time when only birds had the power of flight. But then the right, the plane that gave us the first mouse flight. Story of that courageous mouse? Oh, yes! Tell us, Tim! What this bold little mouse is doing? How rude! <laughs> Get that! Did you see that? And he's terrifically good at outsmarting Thomas. But I hope the mouse finds our box kite useful. Look! Look, Wilbur! The kite's working! Quick, brother, let's return to the shop. From kites, the Wright brothers moved up to full-size hat. This version, they tested models in a device they called Lunch. I've made bouillabaisse. Wrong with the wind tunnel. Woody, a biplane! With the design of the right flyer completed, this propeller is broken and we need two to fly the plane. Flying! Where did the mouse find another propeller? And that's just how it happened on December 17th. Oof, some corroboration? Isn't that the way it happened, Tom? Everybody will meet back here in 15...
Does you see that? Was good fortune. Go! Go! <laughs> Stand! After all, just because that mouse earned it doesn't mean he deserves it. His gold deposits. I'll start us off. Oh! <clears throat> Lemonade. You's got the A way that's Let him get away. For insects. Ah! The cattle top! The cattle! <gasps> we did it, pal! <laughs> now let's get this loot to the hall. Let's take a look. Hmm. Sorry, but this is record. <laughs> and this is nothing more than a turkey leg painted gold. Yeah, Jerry, that way. I could keep the real stuff safe and be very comfortable in your new home. In! July 4th, 1776. The city fell at one that will go down in history. At long last day is a momentous day, and I, Thomas Jefferson, must make ready. But that cat with. I give you the declaration. There comes a true patriot. Thank you, we sir. Declaration of Independence was signed by Congress. And if you... ...history of aviation, but I've saved the best for last. Big Brothers came along and invented the very first air... Um, don't you mean man flight? No. Well, 
It all started in the Wright Brothers Bicycle. No need to be alarmed, Orville. I'll call your worthless cat. <laughs> Mouse Thomas. Orville? I did, Wilbur. I did. I think that mouse knows something. A combination of those skills will help with our experiments. Let's begin right away. Here he comes. And your cat is close behind. Let's just hope your cat doesn't create too much draft. The mouse caught a thermal up. Up. Thomas, pick up that kite. Gliders, big enough to carry a man. Now, the Wrights were ready to make a plane that could take a wind tunnel. I simply cannot figure out what is wrong. Is our plane all right? I got you. The crew packed up and traveled to the testing fields in Kitty Hawk. Well then, we just need to figure out how to fix it. It's wonderful. It's thrilling. It's it's. <laughs> You just stand there. 1903. Well, the humans will get all the credit, but it would. Yep, that's pretty much it. Minutes. Tom, looks like our little mousy friend has struck gold. <laughs> We're gonna be rich! <laughs> yeah! Gold! Financial. If I catch you crooked kittens jumping anyone else's claim, <laughs> well, that takes care of that. Oh, I get it. Downstream from the mouse, too. Seems all legal like. I should do nicely. <laughs> Yahoo! My wretch! <laughs> well, that's the last of it. Rodents mined out all the gold. Okay, Tom, that's plenty. Huh? You first, termite wrangler. Let's get the... Oh. Pyrite, fool's gold. And this, you fools are wasting my time. I got the real gold and sound. You are going to be a very... Jail! I knew this was a lousy idea.
serious business. The requirements are very demanding. Lifeguard must be alert. Okay, boys, your first test will be Dively will keep score. She's very good at figures. I shall go first. Slight advantage, Droopy. Good luck. I shall do my best to avoid... Oh. Ready, Droopy? Oh, I just can't make up my... Sounds smart. Help! Help! after eating before going in the water. Everyone stand back. I know. You know, I almost hope it That was some rescue, Droopy. You get the job. Thomas, I so enjoy the peaceful solitude of a cat. <laughs> For conclusive proof of Bigfoot's existence. I'm down here. Peter Gigantic! The name's Sheldon. Nice to meet you. I am starving! Who's that? Scent. This guy is good. Good, but not gifted. We should still do something. Whoa, why? Don't you know what quiet is? Ours! I can't stand no! Hear my big feet! Help! Help! Ow! 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 <laughs> Are you guys starving? <laughs> <laughs> well, he won't be bothering me any- Is- is that you? I thought I heard a noise. A million dollars!
Keep that in mind, Ruby. Oh, and you too, Tom. What? Where did everybody go? Oh, d I'm never going to get this job. <laughs> then from this high board, you'll be judged on... Sports lovers, I'm ready. Ta da! Your next test will be to swim across this to each and every obstacle. Who turned? Ready. On your mark, get set! <laughs> Mine! They're both excellent candidates, so I won't... Uh, save me! Hang on, Tom. So just what to do. One, two. It doesn't wake up. Keep scrubbing, Tom. I'm being tripped. We interrupt this broadcast for a special report. Big. Bigfoot? <laughs> What? Oh. Oh. La, 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 la. Hmm. Ah. 
Attention, camper. Yeah, you. I don't introduce myself to many campers. In fact, no worries. I won't eat you. I'm strictly vegan. I'll be captured and put in a zoo. <laughs> are notoriously cranky during hibernation. <laughs> Thanks, little friends. Always. I wonder whatever happened to Tom. <laughs> She can't guess what the J stands for. She has the most outrageous sense of humor. Maybe that's where I get my... Bobby! He's adorable. Oh, me, oh, my, no. But I wouldn't feel too bad if I... Behave yourself! If we don't win that gold star... are delightful. Now you... Oh my... Accepted for the you better get ready. This could make all your dreams come true. Do you think it's fair that such a villain for the 103rd annual Society? 
Society of Feline Fancy Buyers. Let's go to the center ring, where Tiger is finishing his run in the... Ad oh, it's a double stick landing. Who's the lucky dope that gets got the speed? Tom clears the first hurdle. Complete with every robotic bonus. Whoa! He cleared the target! But... Let's see how the judges stream difficulty of the course. Sorry. To the center ring for the next event, the talent competition. Based opera, Aliachi. It seems that Tom has given up on opera and is now doing bird liver rock. I don't say this often, but bravo, <laughs> I'm literally speechless. Come all the way from Paris to prepare you for the beauty competition. <laughs> Not to worry, I have just a thing. I think two, three. Something is missing. Vision. My, that's quite a daring of. But why? I suppose not rest on his laurels yet. It all comes down to this. The ch Me. <laughs> the judge isn't going to appreciate that. In the microcat category. No doubt about it. These two are the. Mrs. Two Shoes, that's delicious cheese. Ah, oh, he reminds me of my Desmond, uncivil ramped whisperer. Now Desmond is my little angel whisperer ago. Projecting lazy energy, hmm. and he's fat. Him, you are the kitty leader. <laughs> We will now begin to redirect your... Let's start with this book. Now to increase the difficulty. Mm -hmm. Not quite challenging enough yet. I will now attach it in the back. You two must find a way to create trust on... <laughs> ...tray of treats no matter where she is in the house. Three seconds! Marvelous job. All it takes is calm, assertive lead. What is that silly cat wearing? <laughs> Everyone remain positive. Get that thing away from me! Calm, get back in there and be Don't make me assert my body! Why, hello. Or I'll give you a hint. It's Gerald. Although Gerald, a dynamic personality. Anywho, my mom. Once I get in front of the class and dazzle them with my over you, I'm sure you're a very nice kitty. You show that mouse you're sorry. Cool. Ow. I'm taking.
taking you back to the pound! <laughs> Sit still and be nice to these other pets. <laughs> But the turnips are fresh this year. Yes, you! If you... His dreams should come true? Then... Catch yo! I'm your host, Buster Crane! Here with the agility competition! Oh! To follow that... Tom, who is listed as an alley catcher's And the second! Survive the mechanical alligators. Those score Tom's run. A perfect ten. And now, the big finish! I mean no offense, monsieur, but surely your eyebrows... What wax? Made by Parisian bees. Nothing but the best. Cosmetics to the rescue! I know! What you need is the perfect hair appearance. Another ten of the bees! Who's he's just lucky? Judge is awaiting Tom's arrival. As are we all. Here comes Tom and... Disqualified! But wait, a winner has been best... And cutest... Kittens in the show! Good. This is a wonderful party. Yes, these finger sound... Disobedient. That was until it was tamed by Casper Lodo. Hello, I am Casper Lombardo, the Cat Whisperer. And Rude, give him a command. All right, Thomas. Oh my, what did you do? I did nothing to hurt him for negative conduct. Remember that a good pet maintains his. Con Excellent! Let's add this. Oh, see! Sí. Perfecto! You're wonderful, Casper! It's... Your leash... 
to this large, angry dog. This is how you will learn on this friendship walk. Remember, trust keep... Talk. Every time... Good kitty! Mrs. Two-Shoes, I get a ship. Thomas, fetch the main course. <laughs> He's attacking your negative energy. Actively submissive. Wow. You Dominance! Yeah! Create the solution! I give up! <laughs> Out of my garbage, you know.
See the amazing albino cat and mouse. The astonishing Tom. Cut him loose before he eats us.
so good, cat. <laughs> Hey, fellas, you need some work? Oh. Two of a kind. They're white as snow. Boy, if this is 
the Southland, I want to go back north and freeze. Gee, thanks for the whip, mister. Yeah, don't mention it, kid. I'm going as far as Miami. I got a big job planned there. I, I, I mean, uh, I got a job there. <laughs> wow, I feel a policeman. Oh boy, we're going south real fast now. We got you, Blackie. Pull over. <laughs> We were just hitching a wide south, sir. Hitchhikers, eh? Don't you know it's not a good idea to hitch a ride with anyone? Oh, boy, I believe we're gonna make it this time. Tomorrow. I know, I know. Am I seeing double? That's it. Stop the car. I've got it. Doubles. We'll use doubles. Wait here. I'll be right back. Hey, oh, hold on. Wait a minute. Glad to see ya. Morris Williams, Star Maker. How'd you boys like to be in showbiz? I can make you rich, famous, the idol of millions. I can make you stars. Just sign the dotted line. Report tomorrow to Panic Pictures, downtown Hollywood. Bye. Tent Man meets Ding Dong. Take one, see one. Oh! Amazing! No one could ever tell the difference. Yes, amazing, I dare say. And you'd better be good, or else. We will keep shooting and stop only for your doubles to take your place for the realism scenes, okay? Okay. Ready, light, camera, action! Police Chief to Catman! Ding Dong, the creature from outer space, has escaped! We need your help! Let's go, Reuben. We must save the city. Or else... Ding Dong is not around here, Reuben. 
Perhaps if we went up higher. Cut! Doubles on the set! Realism coming up! A star's work is never done. We must capture Ding Dong to the cat car. Cut doubles. Take their places. Oh, dear. We need a vacation. Oh, we certainly do. Doubles into the cat car. Let's go, 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 go. Giant creature for you, officer. Cut doubles on the roof. You throw the cab rope to the other roof and swing down. Get it? Cut. Ready for stars close up. Oh dear, another tough scene. I'll save you, Ruben, old chap. Cut. Thanks, fellas. Uh, move that camera in for a close-up. I 
I shall see the new apprentice to replace you. Aha! Uh -huh. Or even better! Two for the price of one! Ah! So glad you volunteered to be my new apprentices. Huh? Uh, me? Replaced by a cat and mouse? You can't do this, master! I can do anything! And you can go chase your tail! Okay, Master, since you put it that way. Now, for my new apprentices. Clean up this messy magic room and see that my props are in order for tonight's big show. Whilst I map. Boy, are you guys going to be sorry for stealing my job? Uh, just as soon as I catch my tail. What's 
going on here? Oh no, I'm dead Zeus! Did a tornado strike here whilst I left? I'll soon find out. Oh, all seeing eye, show me what caused this calamity! Yes, monster. So, my apprentices and ex-apprentices are the reasons, eh? You under my most diabolical spell. You know, fellas, I wish we could start this day all over. Ah, so glad you volunteered to be my new apprentice. Oh, no. You mean we gotta go through all this again? Anybody can be a magician nowadays. You're right, Master. The business is going to the dogs. <laughs> this is the city, uh, city. Once a peaceful, busy town, it is now caught in the iron grip of crime. Uh, crime. People are afraid to go out. Fiends like the bowler are on a rampage. <laughs> I see the robber baritone is another sour note. No rainy And no billboard is safe from the mustache. As if this were not bad enough, striking fear in the hearts of all food peddlers. Oh, no! Weighing in at 300 pounds, Pat Woman is on the loose. Yummy! When asked why he couldn't stop the crime wave, Police Chief Joe Federndern said, Unfortunately, my hands are tied. I sure wish Super Kate would come to the rescue. I wonder where he can be. Hello, Pete Taylor Shaw. This is Stanley Kate. Uh, uh, I mean, Carter. Could you send my suit and hat over, please? Yes, Mr. Carter, right away. Uh, Tom, Jerry! Uh, get this stuff over to Mr. Carter's house. Apartment 10C. <laughs> Oh, it's you. Come in, quick. Oh, thank goodness it's you. One never knows who's at one's door nowadays. Yes, it is I, Super Kate, champion of niceness, but just a shadow of what I used to be. I suppose you're wondering why I let crime go unstopped on the streets. The sad truth of it is, I have lost my courage. Oh, if it ever gets out, my arch enemies will strike at me at any moment. And that is why I have asked you to bring my civilian clothes. I am all washed up. Hark! It's my arch enemy, the bowler! Right you are, chicken super king. And I'm here to bowl you over. <laughs> Oh, goodness. You just ruined my wall. You win, Super Kate. You knocked the pin oh. out from under me. I'll be nice from now on. I know the score. That rumor about you being cowardly sure was false. Bye, sucker. <laughs> oh! I was only fooling, Super Kate. Please, spare me. You may split. Turn in your bowling shoes and go directly to jail. Thanks, Super Kate. Tom and Jerry, 
you have given me new courage. And for your reward, I'm making you deputy super capes. Together we shall fight badness and rid our city of crime. Super cape? You're back in action, you say? Sure, I've got crimes for you to fight. At this very moment, your arch enemy, High C, is headed for the Navi Piano Store. This is a job for Super Cape. Oh, yes, and for Tom and Jerry, too. Da 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 da! Goodness, that scared feeling is coming back. I'm getting cold feet again. Tom and Jerry, you will have to go on ahead while I grapple with my nerves. You must stop High C before he sings and breaks the window. Go to it! Oh my goodness! I forgot to tell them how to pull out of a dive! my high note, which will shatter the glass, and the piano is mine. Do, re, mi, fa, so. <laughs> I've lost my voice! Da, 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 da. Super King! The window was broken before you even got here, so you were off key from the start. Foiled by Super King! <laughs> Breaking the glass was very clever, Tom and Jerry, Super Cape deputies. Wait, it's a message from the Chief on my two-way radio bracelet. Yes, Chief? The mustache is messing up all the posters over at Billboard Row. Stop it! Now, here's the plan. You two will paste up these self-sticking posters to slow him up. Then, I come from behind and grab him. Get it? <laughs> oh dear, he's there. But my cold feet are back. All right, you two, what's this all about? Something around the corner, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Another one! <laughs> Yikes! A real cop! And you're going to a real jail! Son of the car! Super Kid, my arch enemy! You're behind this! Nice work, Super Kid! Your two deputies led him right into a trap! Good work, boys! Your actions have given me the courage to go in alone! No man alive can frighten me again. No man, do you hear? Da -da -da -da. No, no, help! Not you! I forgot about that woman. I quit. The job is all yours. Da -da -da -da. So once again, the city is at peace, and clothes are delivered each day without fear from the little tailor shop, because Super Capes, Tom and Jerry, are on the job. Delivery! Boy, there go two real Super Cape heroes. Once upon a time, in a small village near a big castle, there lived a poor little orphan girl named Cinderella. Cinderella lived with her two mean stepsisters and her mean stepmother. Okay, baby cake, I'm your mean stepmother for this story, and you better believe it. You don't look convinced. Stand at attention when I'm talking to you! All right, let's get cracking. I want the windows washed, I want the dishes washed, oh, I want the floors swept. But most of all, I want my two beautiful daughters made ready for the ball. Yeah. Well, 
Demi cute daughter? Well, how about somewhat less than repulsive daughter? Would you buy that? Well, what are you waiting for? An early snow? Get moving! Now, my two sweet pussycums, it's time to get ready for the ball. Now listen, you freeloading cat. You're making a bigger mess than before. Hmm. I don't remember no dumb cat in this fairy tale. Now, my princess, darling, are you ready yet? No, because Cinderella is not helping enough. Well, if some people can help out around here, well then, some people wouldn't be able to go to the ball. Right, girls? Yes, mother. <laughs> Cinderella! Cinderella, help me with my powder wig. Cinderella, I need help with my lipstick. And hurry up. Cinderella! You pet. Come, my two enchantresses. That was really mean of that mean stepmother. I mean, really. And those two mean sisters, if you know what I mean. What this story needs now is a fairy godmother to lighten things up, if you get my meaning. Ooh, ooh, here I am, your fairy godmother. I think I'm your fairy godmother. Oh, yes, of course I am. Nobody else looks like a fairy godmother around here. So it must be me. See, I have the regulation wand with that sparkling stuff coming out of it. Well, I'm sure I'm a fairy godmother. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, oh. Of course, I've got to be a fairy godmother, don't I? I'll prove it to you. <laughs> I'll do a little magic. I'll change that mirror on the wall into a clear blue lake. <laughs> Here I am, your fairy chicken. Oh, why, that's not right. Oh, what am I again? You're our fairy godmother. Oh, of course. How silly of me. I'm your fairy godmother. And you have to get ready for the ball. First, you're going to need a team of white horses to pull your carriage. That doesn't seem right. I know a pumpkin has something to do with this story. Well, anyway, we still need a carriage. Oh, now let's see. Maybe the dress goes on the pumpkin. That's it. The dress goes on the pumpkin. Wow. Dynamite. Oh, hello again, darling. Now we need glass slippers. Oh, oh my goodness. It's Chicken Rella. No, that is definitely not the name of this story. Oh, is this one never do, dearie? Oh, why don't you go just as you are, and I'll go on the horse carriage. To the ball! Listen, Prince, you have got to get married soon. Do you know what the taxes are on an unmarried prince? You're breaking the kingdom. I know, I know. Oh, your friendship. I'd like you to meet my two lovely daughters. You'll not find two more gorgeous girls in all your kingdom. Right, girls? Right. Yuck. 
show the nice Christy how well you dance. Yikes! Uh, pay no attention to that silly creature, Felicity. This is the daughter who can trip the light fantastic. <laughs> Say, who are you? I'm Chicken Rella. Uh, I mean, Cinderella. Oh, oh, sorry. I have to run. Cinderella, wait! We both know how the story is supposed to end, so why don't you just put out... No! Now that's not fair! This fairy tale always ends the same way and we don't like it! We spent all that time getting ready for the ball! And what for? What for? We never get the prince! Farmer Jerry, corn farmers. Ah, oh, there's nothing I like better than fresh, sweet corn. And you two like corn, right? But we both can't have it, right? Okay, then I have a deal for you. That corn is ready for picking. So whoever likes it most will have it all by the end of the day. Deal? No trespassing. This means keep out, especially crows. Okay. But how about just one little ear of corn? Because we're friends. Handcuffs. It looks like we're not friends. Well then, fellas. Arrivederci, adios, aloha, adieu, cheerio, farewell, and bye-bye. Ah, corn. Delicious corn. <laughs> Me in here, it's dark and I can't get out. Delicious. Oh, being locked in with all this corn. Butter corn? For me? Sure. Then the trap goes snap, and the bomb goes boom. Ha! But I'll be safe in here while I lasso me some hot butter. Oops. Well, I know that I shouldn't talk with my mouth full of delicious corn. But I think you guys did that just beautifully. I can't believe it. They hid some corn in a toy. <laughs> hey, I'm stuck in here. No fair, you guys fill this with glue. Now. Well, since there's no stewardess, I'll have to serve myself. This one's for Wilbur and Morgul Crow, the first crows to snitch corn.
appears to be ready, I will test it on myself. Down the hatch. <sighs> I don't feel any taller, but I do feel some changes.
<laughs> it's me. I'm the monster. So you see, it's because of this formula that I was turned into a monster. And all because I wanted to be tall. It taught me a lesson that short is beautiful. And now I will destroy the formula forever. Let's celebrate with tea and cookies. Great one! 
They, they jumped into the forbidden zone. Then I must stop them. Before they learn the secret of the planet of the dogs. Too late. They've learned the secret. Yes, it's true. Centuries ago, this was the planet of cats and mice. And us dogs were treated like inferior pets. They left for the planet Earth, so we took over. But now, if you expect to return, forget it. Because I made everyone think you are enemies with my computerized thought control system. Yes, the great one is not just a statue, but a computer. God sees them. You two will be sent into orbit in outer space. Stop, aliens! You can't escape! You can't outrun my jet-powered throne! You'll never find your way out of the forest! I'll trip you down like a dog! Never cat and mouse! <laughs> huh? Impossible! They're gone! Disappear! I must return to the computer thought control and alert everyone to look for them! <laughs> now to activate my thought control center before my subjects start thinking for themselves. <gasps> Attention all dogs! This is the Great One, and here is your thought for the day. You must love all cats and mice. Repeat, you must love all cats and mice. They are your friends. Hey, what am I saying? No, no, don't touch that self-destruct button. Oh, no. Now everyone will love cats and mice, and everyone will think for themselves. Ah! up the rocket leaving the planet Dog Star. Our two stowaway space travelers are aboard, and what a story they'll have to give us! It's a perfect landing! Tell us, Tom and Jerry, was there any sign of life on the planet Dog Star? Ooh, ooh, look who's back! <gasps> Wait, come back! Don't go in there! That rocket is going to the moon! Can you believe it? They're off again. We'll never know about the mysterious planet Dog Star until Tom and Jerry get back from the moon. But we'll all be waiting for our brave cat and mouse turnoffs. Yeah, especially me. <laughs> Trespasses didn't understand. 
Perhaps they forgot my warning. Perhaps this will refresh their memories. <laughs> Huh? You gotta be kidding. You 
you expect me to follow these plans? Affirmative. Take it or leave it even. But remember, progress must progress. Yeah, I guess you're right. And since the road has to go through, you got a deal. Sorry, pals. Maybe it ain't so peaceful and quiet here in the forest prime evil. But at least we saved our happy home. <laughs>
high speed for so they work. <laughs> the crowd will walk. Fellas, I'm embarrassed to call this my tired of coming home to this. And you two are gonna end up kissing as I'm here. You're leaving the mouse alone. Got it? From now on, things are gonna work. Oh, honey. Don't honey me. Look at my beautiful home. Really? Yeah. See? It's that kind of a gra- Oh, he's fine. Look at him, loving on Tom. Hey, what if I took him to obedience school? Maybe he learned how. <laughs> you ain't gonna believe this. He's a whole new dog. 
let me see. Roll over. Bed, sit, lay down, lay there. One little mishap. I promise, Spike will be playing dead. Trying to get me kicked out of here. Thomas, how do you have time being so clever when you have so many? Why, BT, is that your cape? Yeah. Did you know, Thomas? Do they look happy to you? So, so do be a deary dear and clean this mess up. And do it quietly. We need our beauty rest. <laughs> That would have worked. <laughs> what you need, okay? Down there. Turn back the hands of time to re- You couldn't just walk out the door. No, 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 you had to help.
it's not... Of course, you are the birthday boy. I happy birthday, son. This is gonna be your best birthday. <laughs> Everybody go! <laughs> Outsy house! I had the whole thing sewed up until you two- I'm gonna fire up the barbecue! Tom and Jerry here are gonna- What do you say you play some party games? was going on and it was staying that way. It's different. You could smell it in the air. There was something else. Whose green eyes stare into the darkness and see the foul plots and criminals sorted streets, alleys, and fences of this ignoble metropolis, making the night though small, equals Tom in heroism. Together, they're all... <laughs> Suddenly, a knock came in. A doll this beautiful only shows up once in a cat's nine lives. Oh, who's run into some trouble? Fine pointed ears and her well clipped toe claws and everything in. Please, you gotta meet me tonight at my place by the lake. The word is out. I fear someone's gonna try and rob me. Yeah. The cat and mouse detect. A lady in distress. Without hesitation, the cat detective burst through the door. <laughs> the intrepid...
Shoe Cat had had enough. It was time. It would have been easy to take a slow drive to Payback City, but the cat and mouse isn't their old pal, Butch. Fellas, hold on a second! The detectives... What are you doing here? What are you... Because of her! Toodles! She said two goons were fancy feline. Is that right? Get X O Toodles. Toodles. It's in the headline. Then got three suckers in a big fight to distract the dog so she could make. They'd all been taught something. Learn. Peace returns to the hard-boiled streets of Toluca. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
mom had to laugh. <laughs> there were two things. She's been married to that ball for the last... Stolen in the park. Has my name on it. Oops. The mere mention of his name sent fear through animals' hearts. But not... Barkley's owners brought him to the dog park one day and... I forget the ball. I forgot the ball. I can't... Four collars were stolen in a week at the park. Every mouse detective were to catch him, they'd have to go deep undercover. Drinking fountains! <laughs> and fancy collars! For heaven's sake! It was decision time. The choice was an easy one for our fearless detective. <laughs> Back. Peace. There's was coming for revenge. Darn electric senses. Why are you guys? Only I don't know who they are because they were wearing cans. You helping or not? Good. I'm gonna. You're telling me the cat and mouse? Oh, right. That's probably it. Hold on, bub. Went in there, or you took my backpack. Gonna get ugly fast. You would have done it. Polly had Maybe Tom. Thanks to the cat and mouse detectives.
Rotten dreams to you, Kitty. We'll see you in the morning. out. Careful now. There aren't many in your left. Watch yourself, puss. To me. That doesn't work. Mouse that cost you my life. Uh, me, your life. Uh, us, our. What's the matter, boy? Seeing a ghost? Ah! Oopsie. Okay. to the group, so we're gonna do things my way. Pay attention! Then what? We eat him! Time to pay the piper. Get him, boys! Yeah, 
that's right. Listen, fellas. I'm embarrassed to call this my tired of coming home to this. And you two are gonna end up kissing as I'm here. You're leaving the mouse alone. Got it? From now on, things are gonna... Oh, look. Honey? Don't honey me. Look at my beautiful home. Really? Yeah. See? It's that kind of a great. Oh, he's fine. Look at him, loving on Tom. Hey, what if I took him to obedience school? Maybe he learned how. <laughs> you ain't gonna believe this. He's a whole new dog. Let me see. Roll over. Bed, sit, lay down, lay down. One little mishap. I promise, Spike will be playing dead. Trying to get me kicked out of here. Thomas, how do you have time being so clever when you have so many... 
Why, BT, is that your cape? Yes. Yeah. Did you know, Thomas? Do they look happy to you? So, so do be a deary dear and clean this mess up. <laughs> and do it quietly. We need our beauty rest. <laughs> Thought that would have worked. <laughs> of time spell look it up that's what you need okay down there <laughs> Turn back the hands of time to re- You couldn't just walk out the door. No, 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 you had to help. You are the birthday boy. I can't be birthday, son. This is gonna be your best birthday. <laughs> Everybody go! <laughs> Outsy house! I had the whole thing sewed up until you two- I'm gonna fire up the barbecue! Tom and Jerry here are gonna- Say you play some party games.
entertainment to do, so get to entertainment. going on and it was staying that way. It's different. You could smell it in the air. There was something out. Whose green eyes stare into the darkness and see the foul plots and criminals? Sorted streets, alleys, and fences of this ignoble metropolis, making the night so small equals Tom in heroism. Together, they're all... Suddenly, a knock came in. A doll this beautiful only shows up once in a cat's nine lives. Pearl, who's run into some trouble? Fine pointed ears and her well clipped toe claws and everything in. Please, you gotta meet me tonight at my place by the lake. The word is out. I fear someone's gonna try and rob me. Liv. The cat and mouse detect. A lady in distress. Without hesitation, the cat detective burst through the door. <laughs> the intrepid... It was time. Ah! It would have been easy to take a slow drive to Payback City, but the cat and mouse isn't their old pal Butch. Fellas, hold on a second! The detectives... Fancy feline? Is that right? You X O Toodles. Toodles in the headline, then got three suckers in a big fight to distract the dog so she could make They'd all been taught something. Learn. Peace returns to the hard-boiled streets of Toluca. <laughs>
Tom had to laugh. Ah! There were two things. She's been married to that ball for the last... Stolen in the park. Has my name on it. Oops. The mere mention of his name sent fear through animals' hearts. But not... Barkley's owners brought him to the dog park one day and... I forget the ball. I forgot the ball. I can't... Four collars were stolen in a week at the park. Every th mouse detective were to catch him, they'd have to go deep undercover. Drinking fountains! Yeah. And fancy collars! Why? It was decision time. The choice was an easy one for our fearless detective. I'm coming for you! Back. Peace. As it was coming for revenge. Darn electric fences! Knock it off! Why are you going?
guys. Only I don't know who they are because they were wearing cans. <laughs> you helping or not? Good. I'm gonna. You're telling me the cat and mouse. Oh, right. That's probably it. Hold on, bub. Gwen in there, or you took my backpack. <laughs> Gonna get ugly fast. You would have done it. Polly had Maybe Tom. Thanks to the cat and mouse detectives.
We're leaving now, Tom. Rotten dreams to you, Kitty. We'll see you in the morning. <laughs> out. Careful now. There aren't many in your left. Watch yourself, puss. To me. That doesn't work. Mouse that cost you my life. Uh, me, your life. Uh, us, our. What's the matter, boy? Seeing a ghost? Ah! Oopsie. Okay. to the group, so we're gonna do things my way. Pay attention! Then what? We eat him! <laughs> Time to pay the piper. Get him, boys! That's right. Fellas, I'm embarrassed to call this my tired of coming home to this. And you two are gonna end up kissing as I'm here. You're leaving the mouse alone. Got it? From now on, things are gonna. Oh, 
honey. Don't honey me. Look at my beautiful home. Really? Yeah. See? It's that kind of aggressive. Oh, he's fine. Look at him, loving on Tom. Hey, what if I took him to obedience school? Maybe he learned how. <laughs> You ain't gonna believe this. He's a whole new dog. Let me roll over. Ben, sit, lay down, lay down. One little mishap. I promise, Spike will be playing dead. Trying to get me kicked out of here. Thomas, how do you have time being so clever when you have so many? Why, BT, is that your cape? Yeah. Did you know, Thomas? Do they look happy to you? So, so do be a deary dear and clean this mess up. <laughs> and do it quietly. We need our beauty rest. <laughs> That would have worked. Uh, 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 uh,
It's a time spell. Look it up. That's what you need, okay? Down there. <laughs> Turn back the hands of time to re- You couldn't just walk out the door. No, 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 you had to help. It's not... Uh, of course, you are the birthday boy. I happy birthday, son. This is gonna be your best birthday. Everybody go! <laughs> Don't see house! I had the whole thing sewed up until you two I'm gonna fire up the barbecue! Tom and Jerry here are gonna What do you say you play some party games? was going on and it was staying that way. It's different. You could smell it in the air. There was something else. 
Whose green eyes stare into the darkness and see the foul plots and criminals? Sorted streets, alleys, and fences of this ignoble metropolis, making the night, though small, equals Tom in heroism. Together, they're all... Suddenly, a knock came in. A doll this beautiful only shows up once in a cat's nine lives. Earl, who's run into some trouble? Fine pointed ears and her well clipped toe claws and everything in. Please, you gotta meet me tonight at my place by the lake. The word is out. I fear someone's gonna try and rob me. Yeah. The cat and mouse detect. A lady in distress. Without hesitation, the cat detective burst through the door. <laughs> the intrepid... Enough. It was time. Ah! It would have been easy to take a slow drive to Payback City, but the cat and mouse isn't their old pal Butch. Fellas, hold on a second! The detectives. What are you doing here? What are you? Because of her! Toodles! She said two goons were fancy feline. Is that right? XO! Toodles! Toodles! ...in the headline, then got three suckers in a big fight to distract the dog so she could make... They'd all been taught something. Learn. Peace returns to the hard-boiled streets of Toluca.
some had to laugh. Ah! There were two things. She's been married to that ball for the last... Stolen in the park. Has my name on it. Oops. The mere mention of his name sent fear through animals' hearts. But not... Barkley's owners brought him to the dog park one day and... I forget the ball. I forgot the ball. I can't... Four collars were stolen in a week at the park. Every mouse detective were to catch him, they'd have to go deep undercover. Drinking fountains! Yeah. And fancy collars! For heaven's sake... It was decision time. The choice was an easy one for our fearless detective. <laughs> Back. Peace. As it was coming for revenge. Darn electric fences. Why you guys? Only I don't know who they are because they were wearing cans. You helping or not? Good. I'm gonna. You're telling me the cat and mouse? Oh, right. That's probably it. Hold on, bub. Gwen in there, or you took my backpack. Gonna get ugly fast. You would have done it. Polly had Maybe Tom. Thanks to the cat and mouse detective.
Rotten dreams to you, Kitty. We'll see you in the morning. out. Careful now. There aren't many in your left. Watch yourself, puss. To me. That doesn't work. Mouse that cost you my life. Uh, me, your life. Uh, us, our. What's the matter, boy? Seeing a ghost? Ah! Hey. Oopsie. Okay. to the group, so we're gonna do things my way. Pay attention! Then what? We eat him! <laughs> Time to pay the piper. Get him, boys! That's right.
good cat, that sabotage.
delicious cream. Was the night not even a mouse?
Wait a minute, stupid. You don't have to share that mess spot. You get the general idea, don't you? I'm disgusted, right? That mouse was yours first. Go on, swing it! lion has just escaped from the circus. Watch me. If they take me back to that circus, I'll go. Say so you help me get back to the jungle. Just one more little thing. Thank you.
never catch that one. He's a sly one, all right. <laughs> He's the craftiest trout in the whole lake. He's too smart for you fish hunters. <laughs> <laughs> Better fisherman than you two have tried to catch old Chucky. Hey now, don't you two go messing up my campground. Oh, 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 oh,
know something? You really want to know something? That's the last draw! Get out of my forest! You are in my power! You are in my power! Ha, 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 ha. 
A tough break for Jerry, missing his strike. And now he must get all ten pins to make a spin. Wow! What a solid hit! And Jerry picks up his spin! And now he approaches the lane confidently. Wow, this is a real trick shot. Thank uh -huh. 